Hello again everyone and welcome back to Skyrim. We are back here just outside of the Solitude Stables and we're going to wander down now towards uh, Solitude. Uh, well, the, the docks in particular because we have a uh, Sapphire to kill uh, on this ship over here, I believe. Um, we might need to do it somewhat discreetly, but I think we can accomplish that. It's a beautiful little overlook there, isn't it, by the way? Beautiful. Right, we'll go. We'll, 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 we'll go in the docks first. We'll, we, we won't cause any immediate problems. Fancy clothes? I don't do you fancy clothes. Ed brothers. DJ has no words for you. You have no knowledge of who you speak to. Go away. Okay. She's very aggressive for seemingly no reason. <coughs> don't really know what else to say. This is the East Empire Company place. It's like they run a little. It's like they run a little seaside bar. Doesn't look like there's much going on here, really. Staying safe, I hope. Always, always staying safe. And this goes to East Ica East Empire Company Warehouse, which is locked. So I'm guessing I don't need to be in there. It's a big old warehouse, that as well, by the way. Just to throw that out there. Um, I don't know if there's a way in there from Solitude itself. Do we? I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go in there. I'm not gonna go in. It's cause trouble. We'll quick save here though, what do you need? because we need to get aboard this ship. There is an easy way onto the ship, clearly. We'll get our boat out. Are we allowed on? I think we are allowed on. Go on the red wave. What the? Hi. You're not supposed to be in here. Let me guess. You have some business to discuss. I do actually, yeah. Do I just remain silent? Yeah, you know, I, I, I'm, you know, I'm gonna be honest. I represent the Dark. The Dark Brotherhood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You think this is the first contract I've had on my life? I'm a pirate, sweetie. Assassination attempts are an occupational hazard. Now, shall we? All right, see. <laughs> Sorry, Safia. Your life is over. Right. Now, in my defense, she she did take the first swing. You're not supposed to be in here. I don't think that matters right now, Iris, my friend. Hello there. You're not supposed to be in here. You're not supposed to be in here. I, I, I don't think I'm supposed to be in here. I, I'm, I'm getting some, some, some subliminal messages which are somewhat indicative of the fact that I'm not meant to be in here. Could be wrong, of course, but... Just, just the vibe I'm getting from the, from the place, you know. Hello. You're not supposed to be in here. I thought as much. Uh. What's the hell? Right. Is there a is there a captain's quarters here? I don't think there actually is. Is there? Well, we're not really got anything else to do in here anyway. So the the captain's dead. We've killed Safia. So she was very upfront about it. She was very open, so yeah, people people try and kill me, so yeah. Job done, I suppose. I'll be on my way. And again, I I I can I can overstate the fact that she swung first. Therefore, I couldn't really have done anything if you, know, if you think about it. So I'm gonna go back to the Dark Brother. Sorry, that's a fucking oh, that's a hor horrendous symbol, by the way. We go back here. Gonna go to the go inside Dark Brother Sanctuary. We're gonna get our reward for killing Safia, and then I think we're going to um, have our solitude after that. Just gonna get this out of the way first. Shouldn't you be out roaming someone's? Yes, yes. It's on my to-do list. That briefly looked like it was still. It is still slightly glowing there. That thing. 
Right. Nazea, my good man. Still here? What's the matter? Can't handle what I'm throwing your I've way? I've handled everything you threw my way. I said this. Now I am truly impressed. Oh, I wouldn't be. To kill a pirate captain on her own ship, no less. Simply masterful. You've not only earned your payment, but my respect as well. And believe me, Pleasure, friend, sir. Pleasure. That does not my come pleasure. easily. I'm afraid that concludes our business. You have exhausted all available additional contracts. But I'm sure you've got plenty to keep you busy right about now, hmm? All tons. Happy hunting. Thank you, Nazir. In fact, can you train I me a little bit in my armor? I'll teach you how to use it effectively and keep you quick boop, on your feet. Boop, 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 boop. I can't do any more smithing training, so I might as well use it use it somewhere. We're up to 81. 82. 83. Now that's that. So up to 83 lights armor with that now. That's good. Right. So now that's done, we're gonna go back to solitude. Or the at least the at least the, the docks of solitude anyway. All the way up here, or the East Empire Company warehouse, to be to be to be absolutely specific. Right, what time are we on? Nine forty. Oh, it's it's morning again. Brilliant. We spent so long tracking back and forth. It's uh, it's actually ended up as the next day. Okay, well, go across this bridge, I suppose. I'm guessing this will eventually take us to the uh, front of solitude. Front of Solitude, it's a very weirdly proportioned city, but I'm sure that eventually we will get to where we need to go. It's beautiful here, by the way. Like like the sun, the sun glistening, glistening off the uh, off the sea. The views in the distance, like what the fuck? Um, so so two people just dropped into the sea. And there's also a floating man or out, out, out in the distance there who seems to be having a bit of a hard time. I, I'm going to quick save. I'm going to I'm gonna actually go say hello. Just going to see what he... Uh, if, if everyone here is okay, you know, because it seemed like someone took a pretty big tumble. Everyone okay down here? You guys? You guys all right? Warm sands, friend. I think this is the uh, Khajiit caravan. It might be actually, and one of them is one of them appears to have ascended to godhood. Uh, which you know, I'm I'm very happy for him. Uh, I I'm glad that he is he is arisen, so to speak. Uh, I, I just hope he uses his newfound powers for good, and not evil. That's that's all that's all I want from him. I hope he doesn't go, you know. Uh, serving any Daedric princes or lords or anything like that, because that would just be terrible, in my opinion, and I wouldn't recommend that at all. Nope, not even slightly. I also do not think this is the entrance to Solitude. <laughs> I think I've actually gone the wrong way. I think we need to take a bit of high ground here. I thought there was like a path that would like lead up to a door, but uh, or the gate, sorry, to uh, go into Solitude, but no. Uh, yep, my man is still ascending over there. There appears to be kind of like a, a, a sinkhole which has appeared in the in the in the, the ocean as well. Which, um, yeah. So the the the, the waters around Solitude are clearly somewhat troubled, which is you know it, it's a shame to see. But um, I feel that once we've concluded our business as the Dragon Ball, I feel like the waters will be safe to traverse again. Without fear of um, with uh, divine, without fear of any d divine Khajiits or anything like that, you know. So yeah, I I believe I believe in us. I do. I'm sorry. I think I, I think I, I think I just took that joke and just and just slammed it straight to the ground. Right. Now this is the way to solitude. There we go. How did I not see this? I must be blind. Blind as a bat. It's 
If you've come to Solitude to join the Legion, speak to Ricker. If not, just keep your nose clean while you're here, or you'll end up like Rogvir. Rogvir? You're just in time to say hello to Rogvir. Who is Rogvir? He's the sorry bastard who's going to be executed. Oh! A gate guard who let Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he killed the High King. Oh, right. That's a bad offense. Well, he still let him escape. Does that mean that Ulfric, like, got past him? Or he literally allowed Ulfric to escape, you know, by kind of... on purpose? Because that's two, that's two different things, in my opinion. But a quick save outside here, because I feel like an, a number of things are going to happen as soon as we go in here. I could be wrong, but I kind of hope I'm wrong. They can't hurt Uncle Rogvir. Tell right, this, the, this is the execution, then. As far as you need to go home. Go home and stay here oh, until your dear. mother comes. You betrayed us! Traitor! Get on with it! No. Stand back. Wrong you an execution you have Ulfric is a Stormcloak crime. escaped the city after he murdered High King Torik. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed Oh, he did open the gate. Right, fair enough. In that case, he is a bit of a traitor. There was no murder. Story. He beat the High King in fair combat. Such is our way. Such is the ancient custom of Skyrim and all Nords. Doesn't look like we're going to be able to stop this at all, so I'm afraid. On this day, uh, we may have to I just witness to this execution. Now. Oh, I'm so sorry, Rogvir. Oh. D Oh. Right. Well, now that, that pleasant business has been concluded, um, anyone? So you are. <laughs> That's rubbing it in, isn't he? He's already had his head chopped off. You in town, right? If you need a place to sleep, head over to the Winking Skeever. Yes, Captain Aldis. Mind yourself in my city, friend. This here axe in full swing is a right terrible sight. Okay. Well. Rogvir, why did it have to be like this? Not right now. We should have drawn it out some more. We deserved a slower death. You are really sadistic, aren't you? Okay. Uh. It shouldn't have been like this. Damn shame you were a good man. Obviously, you clearly didn't didn't think he was that good of a man if you lopped his head off. Jeez. Right, Winking Skeever. So this is the local tavern. Always worth a look around the tavern, I think. So, what do we have here? Oh, mm, this is about guess, Golden Glow Estate. By your scent, I'd say you were from the guild. But that can't be true, because I told Mercer I wouldn't deal with them anymore. I'm here about Golden Glow Estate. I don't deal in land or property. Now, if you're looking for goods, you've come to the right person. You can drop the act now, Gajole. Oh, wait. Did you say Golden Glow Estate? Uh, my apologies. I'm sorry to say I know very little about that uh, bee farm, was it? You acted as a broker for its new owner. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. I can't be expected to remember every deal I handle. This guy's suspicious as all hell. Identify the buyer and we'll forget what and we'll forget what we know. All right. Had I known this deal would bring me this much trouble, I never would have accepted the gold. I was approached by a woman who wanted me to act as the broker for something big. She flashed a bag of gold in my face and said all I had to do was pay Arangoth for the estate. I brought in the coin and walked away with her copy of the deed. Did she say why she was doing this? Not at all. I tend not to ask too many questions when I'm on the job. I'm sure you understand. Fair enough. However, I did notice she was quite angry, and it was being directed at Mercer Frey. So someone has a... has a vendetta against the guild, or at least Mercer personally. In this business, we rarely deal in names. Our identity comes from how much coin we carry. I think you're lying to me. Look, that's all I know. I never promised you I'd have all the answers. Now, since our transaction is done, I'll be on my way. 
Shadow Golemai, okay. Ah, uh, yeah, let's let's do that now. So as predicted by Mercifer, Golemai pr proved to be quite stubborn and refused to reveal any useful information. I have no choice but to shadow him during his daily routine, discover if he's up to anything that could be used as influence to make him divulge the truth. Well, we shall follow old Golemai around. Hopefully we're not Why forced. Are you following me? I told you I don't know anything else. I was never here. It looks like he's going out of solitude, which is actually good for us, so that means we won't stumble into anything in solitude, which may Ooh, hello. Okay, he's leaving solitude. Is he going down to the docks? That seems like a likely possibility. Very interested as to where he goes. Because we need to know the identity of this buyer. Otherwise, old what's her face in, uh, back in Riften's not going to be a happy bunny, is she? Blackbriar was her name, wasn't it? I Ingen? Ingen Blackbriar? I don't think it was Ingen. I think Ingen's her daughter. Maven Blackbriar, that's it. Maven Blackbriar. There we go. It's been so long since I pursued a Thieves Guild quest. <laughs> you couldn't look more suspicious. <laughs> Just walking around like... <laughs> Gullamai. Gullamai's neck, neck is, is, is a bit loose, apparently. didn't see me here, okay, sir? You didn't see me here. Come on, Gollum, where are you going? You look like you're going down to the East Empire Company. Which is also, which is, which would be very interesting if he's dealing with those. Dealing with those guys. He's then by a company very official, like, they don't seem like they're sort to, to deal with that kind of thing. I could be wrong, though. Like, uh, yeah, like I said, I feel like the East Empire Company wouldn't go all hush-hush about it. But, again... Who knows? Gotta feel that East Empire Warehouse has gotta be there for, for a reason though. Like, I know it's a warehouse for... Because logically a seafront would have a warehouse, but... I don't know, you just feel like there's going to be something in there, don't you? You feel like there's going to be something in there. I mean, I'm pretty sure you get pretty... <laughs> pretty sure he can see me. I'm not going to lie. Oh, was it that? Was it that Argonian? I think it might be that Argonian because she was very agitated when I tried to speak to her, wasn't she? Is my horse blocking Golemai's way? Hilariously. Oh, what? Whatever's happened, he's he's rounded now. Hello there. Yeah, you can't get around that. Okay. What business do college majors have in a place like Sarthal anyway? It's a place we haven't been to Sarthal in months, Mr. Guard. He is going in the warehouse. Right. Okay, that's interesting. Very interesting. Okay. What are you doing in this place, then? I'll give it a moment or two, just so... He, mo he moves away from the door, I guess. Okay. We'll be fine. We'll get in here. 
almost. This is shadowy, isn't it? It's very shadowy, right? I'm going to end this episode here, guys. I think next episode we'll proceed to shadow Gullamai and see what we can find uh, out about what he's doing. See if we can find out the truth behind this mysterious buyer. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you all have enjoyed. If you have, then please do like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I shall catch you all in the next episode of Skyrim. Have a wonderful day, guys. Bye-bye.